Guns N' Roses and Adele taking control of Domain Stadium, the club has moved their training base temporarily to Medibank Stadium, where today the boys took part in their second training session there this week. It will be their final hit out before boarding the flight to Geraldton early Thursday morning in preparation for their 2017 Australia Post AFL community camp. Eagles midfielder Mark Hutchings says the squad is thrilled to combine the annual community event with the club's second JLT Community Series game against the Dockers on Saturday afternoon. Yeah, to take the footy out to places where they don't often get AFL. It's good for us to change it up a bit and it's good for the fans. I'm sure there'll be plenty of West Coast fans, there'll sure be plenty of Frio fans, um, they'll love it. Yeah, up there for a community camp as, as well as the game of footy, so yeah, looking forward to it. A squad of 29 players will be announced Thursday morning, which will include three travelling emergencies who will then spend four days in the WA country town visiting schools, hospitals and aged care facilities while running a few clinics with local coaches and kids. The club has received good news with key defender Will Schofield being cleared of any serious ankle damage from last week's clash against the Giants, although the club will keep a cautious approach with his involvement in the remaining pre-season games. Today, the club also announced their leadership group for the 2017 season ahead, with skipper Shannon Hearn to again lead the side for his fourth consecutive year. Pretty excited to be um, uh, re-elected as captain, so I've enjoyed it the past couple of years and got another opportunity this year, so really looking forward to it and hopefully we can have another good year and um, play some finals footy and um, you know, hopefully win a premiership. In other changes to the leadership group, 2016 John Worsfold medalist Luke Shuey moves into a joint vice-captaincy role, shared with Coleman medalist Josh Kennedy, while new recruits Sam Mitchell and Andrew Gaff are both elevated to a leadership role within the squad, joining current members Jeremy McGovern and club stalwart Matt Prittis. Great to see a couple of new inclusions. Um, you know, Gaffey's come along really well. Gov's been doing a great job past few years and Sam Mitchell with his experience. So we're pleased with what we've got and um, hopefully Blossom keep growing and keep getting better.